I'm Victoria Floyd. I'm a certified nurse midwife with IU Health, and I've been in practice since 2013. I chose to become a nurse midwife when I became a mother. Uh, my first child was born into the hands of a nurse midwife, and that experience changed my life. I felt empowered, I felt seen, heard, and I felt safe. And I knew in that moment that I wanted to be able to provide that care to women for the rest of my life. So when you come and see me for the first time, you can expect a conversation. I want to get to know you as a whole person. I'm curious about why you came in today, about how you see yourself and your health. I'm curious about what your goals and visions are for your healthcare. I know that healthcare is not one size fits all. So whether you're pregnant, experiencing menopausal changes, here for well woman care, or you're having a problem that you're seeking help for, I want to sit down beside you. I want to help you craft a plan of care that's going to really work for you as an individual. The thing I love about being a midwife is partnering with women. Women have these big biological transitions that they experience in their life, pregnancy, menopausal changes, um, choosing the right birth control. And those things are very obvious and physical changes that midwifery care beautifully addresses. There are also mental, emotional, and spiritual transitions that a woman experiences that are just as profoundly impactful. And I want to foster a relationship with you so that you feel really comfortable getting all those needs met and so that you see me as your ally and your resource throughout your healthcare journey. Uh, midwifery, that the magic of birth drew me to midwifery, but the power of women is what keeps me passionate every day. So when I'm not providing midwifery care, you can find me with my family. My husband and I have four children. I love to be outdoors, so you'll find me hiking or running. Any chance I get, I wanna run off to the beach and put my feet in the sand. Um, when I need some quiet time, I pull out my knitting and listen to an audio book.